I know everyone needs work and it's going to be a very competitive field. Yeah, the competition to find workers is fierce for some businesses in downtown Fort Myers. As Fox 4's Colton Chavez found out, it's not the hurricane and damage holding them back from reopening. It's simply the lack of workers. In downtown Fort Myers, three months after Hurricane Ian, window shopping has become less about what's inside and more about simply what's open. People are coming to Social House and they're walking up a couple flights of stairs trying to get to the rooftop bar and not understanding that, you know, we're not open there, but we're open here. We Marissa Gandy works for the Kearns Restaurant Group, a company that owns eight downtown businesses such as Capone's, the Firestone Grill Room, and Social House. The location where a three-day job fair running from 10 to 5 aims to bring in more employees. Some had more damage than the others, so we were able to take our core group from those restaurants and transfer them. Gandy tells me they transferred employees to whichever of the eight businesses were able to reopen. But as time went on, we're finding the challenges of we need to pull those individuals out of the restaurants back into their home base. And now that leaves open spots, open spots that used to be filled by employees that Gandy says Hurricane Ian forced out of the area. It's not that they found other jobs. They've completely they've gone back to New England. They've gone out. Well, you know, they've kind of scattered, kind of panicking. And for the Kearns restaurant group, those worries could only get worse as Firestone is taking this time to renovate. And you can almost feel a sense of urgency down here in downtown Fort Myers. Sign after sign promises of reopening and for places like Firestone, they tell me they use this opportunity to come back better than they were before. They put a lot of work into kind of revamping it. A new look, but with no new promises, there will be enough workers to actually reopen when ready. It's why the restaurant group is hoping to find solutions and find those looking for work. I'm actually new in town. I'm from Texas. Alexandra Drake, a bartender from the Lone Star State, said she moved to Fort Myers to be closer to family, where she hopes handing in an application will land her a job. Kind of seems to like have a lot more opportunities because all these people are coming back together. And if you're interested in applying, the Kearns Restaurant Job Fair again is running through Wednesday. In downtown Fort Myers, Colton Chavez, Fox 4.